Connor and David Wallace have roots in the Skagit Valley. Have you seen these washed yet? Yeah, they look awesome. These brothers know the ins and outs of growing potatoes after growing up on their family's farm. Most importantly for us on the irrigation team, you have to see how much water to put down. So more water, bigger potatoes. During the bulking season, potatoes need up to a quarter of an inch of water per day. So irrigation is an ongoing concern, especially recently. Water is very important, yeah. And uh, in this area, it's actually becoming more important over time. Um, I think even since we were little kids, we've seen the summers get hotter and drier in Skagit Valley. And I feel like it's not just increased demand for water, it's less predictable. So year to year, you could have heat waves or you could have tons of rain. And to make sure they get the perfect amount of water, farmers historically drive around and eyeball the irrigation systems. When things do go wrong in the middle of the night, if somebody's not there to see it, you wake up in the morning to a massive lake in the middle of your potato field and that entire half acre to an acre is then flooded out and ruined. And that can be a huge hit. A half an acre of potatoes could be worth 10 to $40,000. This personal need prompted them to find a solution, tapping into their backgrounds in tech and programming. It was dad saying, hey, we had tons of problem with fields flooding last yeah. year can you figure out something to solve this problem? They spent the beginning of the pandemic in their family's garage designing a solution and their company Farm HQ was born. Our app monitors this in real time and you can see the area that's been irrigated. A device on the side of their irrigation system tracks the location, pressure and motion, sending an alert to farmers if the system stops, then they can turn off the water instantly, preventing that flooding. And they realized their need is not unique. Nearly 30 other farmers in Skagit and Whatcom counties are now using their technology. I didn't really expect to be starting a company out of this, honestly. Yeah. But when we had farms that were asking for it, it became clear that that's what we needed to do. Fixing a growing need, one farm at a time. From my perspective, the number one thing we wanted to do was make farmers' lives easier, make their work easier. For Environment Northwest, I'm meteorologist Leah Pizzetti.